What, what happened to the trees? They were devoured. Oh, trees. Godzilla's marshmallows. You want me to film the scene with you filming No, 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 just look cool. Look, look like you're doing something. Uh-huh. That's like what the world's about these days, looking like you're doing something. Welcome to June. <laughs> uh, it is nine in the morning, uh, which, sound, which is early for me. Uh, I'm going to be spending all day editing whilst waiting for a delivery. And I'm going to show you what I'm editing. Yeah. So last March, which was not this year's March, but the March before. Sorry, I should have already said that. Um, myself, Anna Rafferty, and Oliver Pavey Stillcock started working on a little Doctor Who prequel for Ollie's fan series. We started working on a prequel which was meant to be a visual project that Alan was going to film up in Derby. But it didn't really work out. So we started recording an audio for it instead, which um, I was happy to record my lines for, etc. And then it's just kind of sat here and doing nothing. So I... I've decided to take it upon myself to uh, edit it and seeing as I'm up all day quite early waiting for this delivery which could come at any time I thought I might as well edit it I'll report back when I have done it's now the next day by three minutes and so far it is 41 minutes and 52 seconds which is massive oh yeah and there's Alan hello Alan Hello, how are you doing? All is well. You're all happy? Yeah. I've just been showing Alan some of it because he plays the Doctor. So, uh, yeah. Nearly done. <laughs> the past 24 or so, maybe 36 hours, have been a bit hectic, I'm not going to lie. Um, with the whole editing thing. But now I get to go and meet up with a friend and... Uh, have a good friendship time and also do a bit of filming. So there we go, it's a bit different. I'm about to film Sam's final shot for Time Traveller, technically. I think. Oh. That makes sense. Considering all the wankers they've been fronted. <laughs> That's when the vlog. Oh my god. What's Connor doing? He hasn't had enough, has he? I think he's... We might need to call an ambulance. Oh my dear. Connor, don't do it. You're too young. You're too young, Connor. I'm trying to do it. No, we love you. It's not too... It's You're too early to end it. It's too early to end it. Please. Uh, Go on, Tarzan. Kick away. Someone come down here and kick a chair away. Alas, poor Yowick. We knew him well. Gonna take the chain down, hopefully. Let's give it a go. Hello everyone, I thought I'd make this little segment of uh, 2015 to say I've just filmed a vlog. Ooh. Oh. 
I'll give you that. That's a good effort. Wow. I'm a silhouette. I've just watched Jurassic World and I thought it was pretty good, to be honest. Um, I feel as though there were some little nitpicky things that I found anyway that I just sort of was like, oh, uh, eh, uh, like little bits and pieces. But overall, it was quite a nice film. Apparently, they're planning on making a trilogy from it, and I don't think that's a wise idea personally, but because I think that's quite a nice note to end on for the whole Jurassic series. So, yeah, pretty, that's what I liked it overall, though. I think it's the HMS Belfast which has the, um, the guns that if you fired them they would land somewhere on the motorway. When the people of today are long gone and part of the dust that forms the earth, this temple shall exist as a testament to our times. That's a phone box that's made of metal, not completely wood as I realised when I banged my fist on it as I bumped it. The um, monument is just over there. Um, which commemorates the Great Fire of London in 1666 and they say that if you tip the monument over onto its side the um, radius that it would fall into would be roughly where the fire started. The uh, bit of the dome of the bird just there says the Latin word resurgum which means may I rise again. Um, the story behind the dome is that, uh, I think it was after the Great Fire of London, um, architect Christopher Wren designed the dome and asked a workman to give him a piece of stone masonry to design the dome and it just so happened to have the word may I rise again in Latin on it and it was a quite iconic kind of phrase because it was doing the revitalization of the church cathedral basically. Is it? Ah. Hello Pete. Oh hi. Oh hi yeah. there. Oh hi Pete. Why me wearing shades because it's sunny enough now to wear them. Yay. This is where I got lost all those weeks ago. It's, it's much sunnier now because it was all right. Yeah. Now, Pete, behind us is a group of tourists. Yeah. Do you think we could just join them and see how long it takes them to realise? They don't start speaking in Spanish or French or something. They'll probably say, oh, no, they're not English. They're English. Okay, so do you, do you think we should try it? <laughs> Depends on what language they're speaking. If, if they're speaking French, I can probably sort of. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Shush, oh. But honestly, though, y y yes or no? Uh, we <laughs> come on, Pete. We're going to miss the tour. Oh, we can't. We can't go on. I guess Pete. we just can't go any further. We have to turn right back around again. Oh. Yeah, but it says no. But yeah, but the sign. We have to, have to stop here and go. But back my around. heart says go on. Get our, you know, signs for you. I think it's a sign of things to come. No, he has gone. He's really, he's really, he's really trying, he's really disappeared. Pete? 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 Where are you? <laughs> Pete, I think we have to hold hands. And get in drag as well. Yeah. And one of us has to be tiny as well. Oh. Miniaturised. Or oh, I'm taller. Okay, I'll just have to sort of shrink down. <laughs> a very nice bridge, Daddy. It is. Oh, no, don't do that. No, it's a bit. This is a bit wonky. Um, <laughs> Green cover. Oh, that, that, well, that was fun. Hello. So before we get on to the next segment, I just want to say I watched Game of Thrones last night, and that was the finale. 
of series five. And what, <laughs> what the hell happened? <laughs> wow, okay. So yeah. I'm not gonna say what happened, just in case, but <laughs> what the hell, that's all I've gotta say. Oh. Hello. <laughs> um, I thought I'd do this little segment to I'm feeling, because this month I haven't really felt great. I haven't felt as accomplished as I have in April or May. April and May have been extremely busy months. And uh, it's one of those things where it comes with me quantity over quality and it's really irrational. I know it's irrational, but because I haven't done a lot, I just think I've done nothing. So April and May I was doing a lot of moving and a lot of like this and that, a lot of filming, etc. So I thought, okay, great, doing stuff. But now I'm here, I've moved here, and the same with May, I was doing a lot of moving stuff, but now I'm here in June and I've been able to stay in one place and concentrate on building projects and filming them during the month. So I have been doing things, it's just it's more behind the scenes rather than actually doing things. So in my head it feels as though I'm doing less than I actually am. I got a 52 on my dissertation proposal, which I did last month. And I have since then started to feel a bit bad because uh, I wrote that really last minute because I'd only just moved in here. I was sat here in this room which wasn't even put together. I was just sat in the corner typing away on my laptop trying to get it done. And I'm a, I'm a terrible essay writer without help, and this was me doing it all by myself. And I'm obviously not that great at writing. I'm, I better, I'm better at doing practical things rather than academic things in terms of a theory and everything like that. And I'm really hoping that when my dissertation comes out, I can actually do it good. <laughs> so yeah, so that's a little interlude. I just wanted to say that so that when I watch this back, I can remember it and sort of reflect, hopefully, on things getting better. <laughs> Oh my god, I have got a spot under my eye. That's what I, That's what it was. <laughs> oh no! Oh. It's on the grey part of my face. <laughs> so I've just headed out to go and get a couple of things. And um, when I was there waiting in the line to pay for the stuff, uh, I heard someone, like a child with their mum, say, that's time traveller. And I was like, admittedly, I was a bit... I was a bit like, what? Okay, I'll ignore that because not obviously talking about me. Then someone tapped me on the shoulder, and I looked round, and um, the woman, the mo or the mother, was saying, "Do you know my son?" And I was like, "I'm sorry." Yeah. Um, and she was sort of saying all this stuff like, "My son Liam knows you," <laughs> and I looked at him and go, "I've." I've never met him before. I don't know. And she went, "Oh, never mind." He went, "No, no, that is time travel." And I went. Well, I do make a web series called Time Traveller. And he went, yeah. And I was like, what? I'm a bit, oh, I'm, I'm a bit awkward in, in public sometimes, especially when people call me out and stuff like that. So that was weird. I've got a viewer who I now am aware of in the area. So that's weird. I thought I'd show you this because I haven't actually shown you yet. So here we go. This is a quartz camera from the USSR 1950s. I'm hoping I'm using it soon to make a film.
啊。Hello. Hello. Is this for your fucking 2015 thing? Maybe. Hello, Donal. Hello. Fuck. You you barely you barely changed. Fuck you. Hello. How has summer? Well, it's only really just begun when you think about it. But winter is coming. Pete, how are you enjoying yourself today? I'm trying to read the script, but the Kindle's kind of fucking up. So. Yeah, it's going all right, but lovely location. Mm. Donal? Yeah. Same question. What? Same question. What was the question? <laughs> How are you enjoying yourself? Um, yeah, good. Good. Time traveller. We've started filming. We finished filming Deception now, actually, which I was mentioning in the last uh, video. We've now started filming on the final act, which is the final time traveller special, and we uh, filmed scenes for that. Um, I've had a pretty good month actually towards well, the middle onwards. Um, when it first started this month I did feel a bit, uh, I didn't really um, really do much. But since I've started doing more this month and sort of get back into the swing of things, things have been feeling better and I've been doing more filming. I've finished projects now. The first half of next month is going to be cool. Thank you for watching June and I hope you will enjoy July. Farewell.